the season for them? Our number one goal is definitely make the GLIAC tournament. Um, we're just over halfway done with our season, so I think it's definitely within reach to get to the tournament and hopefully do really well there. Uh, that's kind of the big measurable goal that we have. But more than anything, just to kind of keep up our positive attitude and getting through these matches. Our season is really tough by having so many matches in a really short period of time. Uh, so pushing them to try this so hard every single weekend with matches gets to be a lot, and I understand that. But my biggest goal is so, you know, every match is a new match, and we can try just as hard as we did in the previous one. And seeing them have so much fun while they're doing it, um, watching the girls compete is the best thing that I get to do all year is our season. So getting to watch them have so much fun is kind of my biggest goal too. Uh, making sure that they enjoy every match and being at practice still. Uh, I really like to see that, so that's definitely one of my biggest goals. Practice is tough. I push them pretty hard. Um, we practice for normally about two hours, and it kind of consists of warming up, lots of footwork, and then we normally kind of designate days to singles or doubles and work on specific drills, and we do a lot of match play. I think it's important to get a lot of sets in during the week uh, just to make sure that we're build working on point strategy, understanding how to build up points, work with pressure situations. Uh, we also do a morning um, of just strength and conditioning type exercises where I kind of push them with ladder drills and a lot of running and making sure that we're working on our footwork and quickness. Um, we'll really progress more into that in the off season, but I uh, can't tire them out too much in season, so we just really work on it once or twice a week with some extra running at practice. But everyone's handling it really well, and I've seen such a bigger push in you know our conditioning on court and having the stamina to last through three tough matches on the weekends. So I think it's working pretty well. So many developments. Uh, you know, every match we kind of compare it to where we were last year. And for example, we just played Tiffin and we had lost to them um, pretty handedly last year. And this year we beat them 6 3, so it was a big development. Um, you know, not just from the winning standpoint, but just on the court at practice, everyone has just got, really picked up the pace and the intensity, uh, much more footwork, being able to move at a better pace. Um, the, you know, challenge matches, everything have just become much more competitive. So. Between last year and this year, it's really not comparable. It's a brand new team, great new start for us, and uh, a great building year for our program. I think the future is really bright. Uh, we're attracting some great recruits. Every week I talk to a new girl that just seems like they would be a great fit here. Um, I'm seeing, you know, between the new complex that's being built for indoor tennis and hopefully new courts one day, uh, our facilities are just kind of backing up the quality and recruits that we're getting. Everything just looks very, very bright in that we keep kind of making a stronger name for ourselves in our conference. I've had many of the other coaches kind of come up and say, wow, you guys are really you know, progressing and making great strides at becoming a tough team. And I know a lot of other teams are kind of you know, scared to play us this year, which is a great feeling. So just being more competitive and keeping up that drive to get better, that's kind of what I'm seeing for our future to keep going.